G'day, Duan here. Over the past couple of years, uh, City of Launceston have been informed by the customers that come to the city that they would like some more optional payments uh, for parking, especially on the street. So you would have seen uh, over the last uh, week or two, some new meters going in around the city. These new parking meters will give you the option whether you pay by coin, by card, or for those who use the phone app can still use their phone app. So there's multiple flexible payment options for all those who are coming to the city to visit. There's one small change that you will notice uh, when using these machines from the previous machines is that we don't put in the bay number anymore. What we're doing is we're using your registration number for this zone. So whether you use this machine or one that's on the other side of the road, that doesn't matter. As long as you've put in your registration number, the officers will know that you've paid to park within this area here. Okay, so I'll take you through now of how we operate the machine. You'll see these new machines have lovely bright clear colored screens, so a lot easier for those people that have trouble with the older type of meters. First of all, it says welcome, press the OK button to start. So down here, this is not a touch screen, everything is done through the keypad, so you press OK, it beeps, and then it'll bring up a screen for you to be able to put your registration number in. So I'll just put uh, a registration number in here. And then once you've got your registration, if it's correct, you press OK to validate that. It will then give you a screen with which option of payment. If it's a coin, all you need to do is start inserting your coins like you did the old machines. So you place it in here. It will register. So you've put 20 cents in, got a few minutes. And if that's all you needed, then you just press OK and you are done. So that's all the process it is for using the coin. If you want a receipt for tax purposes, it says do you want a receipt, you can press OK or you can press quit or you just walk away. That's all there is for using these machines for coin. I'd now like to take you through the process of using cards to make payment on these parking meters in the city. So the same process as before, you just need to press OK to start place in a registration number. As long as that's OK, you then press OK to confirm. It will now say card or coins. We want card, so we now use these blue buttons here, the plus and minuses. When we use those, it's now indicating to the machine how much time you want, and you select that through the buttons, not with the coin. If you're using coins, do not use these buttons. These buttons are telling it that you want to use a card. So when you've selected the amount you want, Okay, you then go OK. You present the card. Four little green lights come up. It says remove card, please wait. And it's approved. Just make sure it says approved on the screen. And then if you want a receipt for taxation purposes, you just press OK and it will print out a receipt for you to take away. These receipts do not need to be displayed on your car at all. This is only for taxation purposes. These parking stations, I've uh, got a couple of changes to what we've been used to in the city of Launceston. One, we used to do bay numbers, that no longer exists. It's all to do with the registration of your vehicle. Some people are like, oh, I can't remember my registration number. One tip is take a photo of your registration plate, have it in your phone, and then you can bring that to the machine and be able to put in the correct registration number. The people that use the parking app, can still use the parking app as they always have on their phone. Um, that's much easier and you'll, you'll notice there's probably a couple of less machines in the streets now and that's because it doesn't matter where you go within this parking zone, you'll be able to just put in your registration number and pay on any of the pay stations within the area. So the number one important thing is put in your registration number, not your bay number. Make a payment option, card or coin and if you want a receipt, you can get a receipt. So for taxation purposes. So I hope that uh, this explains how to use these new machines we have in the city of Launceston. Uh, they're pretty simple. If you have any more issues, uh, just talk to one of the officers and they'll help take you through it.